midfield in a conventional back four. I believe there's been a goal in one of the other matches, Alan McAnally. It's a goal for the visitors. Seven minutes played, 1-0. Thank you, Alan McAnally. Powell, he has plenty of support. It had an invitation attached, but he couldn't avail himself of the opportunity. Well, just look at him. He thinks he's in just wide. Aaron Wildig. Well, let's see about the cross. A decisive clearance it was. Position to give them the lead, maybe. It could be up for grabs. Well, he stumped it out of there without much fuss. So now a corner. Corner kick played over. Not really the ideal clearance. Well, let's get details of a goal that's been scored in one of the other games from Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Oldham Athletic. 19 minutes played, 1-0. Many thanks, Alan. And no-nonsense defensive clearance. Terrific block there. What can he do from here? Wonderful block. And he's clear his lines. Maneuvering his way forward. And a good looking ball. Genuinely thought they might cash in on that occasion, but haven't been able to do so. Well, you never quite know who's going to dominate a game in advance, but I think you can maybe make an argument for this fellow. Lee, what do you think we'll see from him? Well, I expect goals, Derek. The form he's in, you expect goals every time you see him. You'd hope that back line had been studying the takes, but most of the teams this season haven't worked him out. Do they have the guile to up and up the defence? Well, not to be in terms of the counter-attack. A goal has been scored in one of the other games. Alan McAnally has the news. It's a second goal for Oldham Athletic. 32 minutes played, 2-0. Thanks very much as always, Alan. Well, Derek, there's nothing between these two teams in terms of possession. Can someone take control of this game? Take a few more risks? Hopefully we'll see a goal soon. That move looked as though it had genuine potential, but it's broken down. Young. And scope for them to produce something exciting. Still passing it around with authority. Competent goalkeeping. Yeah, right place at the right time. Foils the attacker. Bravo. He continues his run. Crossed accurately towards the far post. And it is the opening goal of the contest. Well, it was always going to be a tight game, but now all of a sudden one team ahead. Things have got to change on both sides. So the match has restarted. 1-0 here. The and the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. Of added time. Not much defensive cover there on the flank. And so it is. The first half story has been written. The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. And giving the ball to the opposition that time. Can he take advantage? Really important tackle. It's in. They're looking really relaxed and confident and not giving the opposition much of a look in. Well, sometimes goals happen on the training ground before the game. I'm sure they practice this. Great movement, great cross, perfect goal. It's going their way, 2-0. He continues to make hay. 
Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Well, the clearance half-hearted. I believe there's been a goal in one of the other matches. Alan McAnally. It's a second goal for the home team. 53 minutes played. 2-0. Thanks as ever for the update, Alan. And whipped into the box. Danger averted. They're trying to get right into his face. Chance to attack using wit. That's an effective cross aimed at the back post. Good vision. Can he get onto this? Electing to cross into the centre. Thumped clear. Making excellent progress with the ball at his feet. And delivered towards the back post. Not too fussy in clearing his lines. Targets available. Cross comes in. And behind it goes the concession of a corner here. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. A good and fair challenge. Space on the flank. Well, someone has found the net in one of the other games. Here's Alan McAnally to tell us more. It's a goal for Stevenage. 70 minutes played, 3-1. Alan McAnally keeping us right up to date. Playing with purpose and control. Really good reading of the game to win possession back. Palmer. And space for the cross. Not all that hard to deal with crosses like that. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Options in the centre. Well, it fizzled out. Just too close to the goalkeeper in the end, wasn't it? Yeah, poor technique, really, and the goalkeeper's not troubled. Young. Just ten minutes to go. Well, let's get details of a goal that's been scored in one of the other games from Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Bradford City. Six minutes remain. 1-1. One, one. Regular updates from Alan McAnally along the way. And threading it forward. Decided to come in from the flank. Will he finish? Well, it was fired straight at the keeper. No real difficulties for him. No, decent position from the goalkeeper. Poor shot, to be honest with you. Aaron Wilding. No hiding from the fact that that was a very poor effort. Oh, look away right now. Look at that. Absolutely awful effort. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. And plenty of scope to be creative in that wide position. A delivery towards the back post. Keeper did his job to begin with. We have entered the final minute of normal time. That's it, the referee brings...